Hi there, my name is Michael Neff and I am the founder and director of Gear Sports. And today I would like to make a video on the golf shaft. And in particular inside of Gears, we have a feature that we like to call scissoring effect. And the scissoring effect is a feature that we like to use to help us determine what type of shaft uh, you need. Uh, because Gears is the only product in the world that measures the entire golf club throughout the entire swing and the body at the same time, uh, we are uh, able to very accurately measure why a shaft does what it does and we've decided to design our own shaft, which we are calling the Gears Ovio shaft. Ovio means obviously in Italian. So I hope after this video that will make sense to you. Um, but to illustrate the scissoring effect, uh, I have picked David Toms here. David Toms is a multiple PGA Tour winner and won a PGA Championship. And Ricky Fowler, who's also won many times on the PGA Tour. Both of these players have had tons of success. And as you can see, they have a very different... Uh, release pattern. They have a very different golf swing and this is proof that there's more than one way to get it done out there on the PGA Tour. Uh, but what we're going to highlight here is the scissoring effect. And when exactly the scissoring effect occurs in the golfer's down, downswing determines the shaft profile that golfers should use to maximize their performance. In our case, the OVO has three profiles, green, blue, and red. So when the grip speed starts to slow down, the club head speed starts to speed up. And the peak grip speed, meaning the time in the golf swing where your grip speed is the fastest, is really important to determining this. As you can see in how different these two players are, uh, that Ricky basically, ha uh, his peak grip speed is much earlier in the downswing. And when that happens, you're going to have a lot more shaft deflection versus David Toms, who does this very late. And as we go to impact, you can kind of see both of them, how much uh, the blue shaft is Ricky, how much more his shaft deflects than does David's. In fact, it deflects about twice as much, 33 for David, 60 for Ricky. So they need very different products for very different reasons. But in order to figure out what you need, it's better to know when this scissoring effect occurs for you than it is to know just what your club head speed is at impact to determine what kind of shaft you need. So that, that scissoring moment is super critical and knowing what profile of shaft that you should need. Look how much different these two shafts bend. Uh, different places, different moments. And club head speed is, is one way of determining what kind of shaft you have, but it's not the most responsible way and it's not the most accurate way. So we have to be, if we want to make really good decisions on our equipment, we have to be more accurate. We have to be more disciplined in our approach and get real science and real math as to determine what we really need. So I hope you enjoyed this and I hope this makes sense. And I think you'll really enjoy this new Gears Ovio shaft. And more importantly, you can go get on any Gears system worldwide to figure out what your scissoring effect is and where your scissoring is occurring so we'll know which best profile to give you. Thank you very much.